Welcome to Ben's Experience. In this video, I will share with you how to edit the design of the header section in Hostinger Website Builder. First, log in to your Hostinger account. Then, from this left side menu, click on Websites, then select Websites List. Now, select or click on this Edit Website button next to the website you want to work on. Just a little tip. If you have a long list of uh, different websites to differentiate between WordPress websites and uh, other websites built using Hostinger Website Builder, just look for these little icons next to each website. For example, this uh, first website is a WordPress website and the second one is a, uh, a website built using Hostinger Website Builder. Click on Edit Website. This is the header section of this uh, website and to edit its design, it's simple. First, click on the header section to select it like that. Then click on edit header from here. A new window pops up. The first thing you can edit is to make the header section sticky or not. Now it is not sticky and now it is sticky. To uh, get an idea of what sticky means, let's view this website live. Now, if I scroll down, the header section sticks to the top. You can let's uh, make it not sticky or let's disable this feature. The second thing you can edit is this element spacing, which I don't know to be transparent with you and the second or the other settings or the other design editing is the link spacing between these buttons of your menu now they are uh, close to each other and now they are away from each other you can also edit the top and bottom spacing of the header section let's make it I, I like this uh, narrow top and bottom spacing. The other thing you can edit is the placement of each element of the header section. This is the default one. This is a second uh, one with the menu buttons uh, close to the website logo. You can also uh, you can uh, place the menu buttons on the center you can make the logo is in the center you can make both the logo and the menu in the second in the center i i think i will go with this with the logo on the center now let's go to the elements tab you can hide or show the logo before I continue this tutorial, I would like to let you know that you can get access to my online course about hosting a website builder today for free. Inside this course, you will learn many things including how to get started with hosting a website builder, how to set up and design your website inside hosting a website builder, also how to create and manage your content, how to optimize your SEO, e-commerce and payments uh, features or settings and also how to integrate and use custom codes inside Hostinger Website Builder and also long tutorials like how to build a handyman website, a personal training website or just a portfolio website. If you want to get access to all of these courses today for free and also my other free online courses inside my university, just go to university.benzexperience.com link in the description. Without any further ado, let's continue our tutorial. You can also add or you can show or hide the social icons to your social uh, platforms and you can also add or uh, uh, show this big button. This is a good button to have. I, I recommend you to use this button to the most important thing for your website or for your business. Let's say you have a blog and you collect email addresses. You can make this big button your join my newsletter button. 
let's say for example you have a down a free downloadable uh, book you can also uh, link it to this button now let's go to the logo tab from here you can upload or change your website logo just click replace image and let's select this uh, mailchimp logo for example to upload your own logo just click on upload files locate your logo on your computer and double click it to start uploading it to hostinger let's go with this uh, logo you can also adjust the size of your logo from using this slider now let's go to the style tab to edit the header the button the header design button design or the social icons design let's start with the header design you can select the header background let's you can pick your color from here i will keep it white you can make your uh, header section background transparent just like that I will disable this feature you can select or change the header text font you can uh, select your new font from this list or you can upload your own font or your own text font from your computer I will go with this bold text font called Roboto <clears throat> you can also edit your uh, header text font from here you can use this slider or pick colors from here now let's edit the style of this button make sure to select it from this list and you can disable it or enable it from here you can edit the text button for example join my newsletter and after that you can add a link to a page to a web address to a specific section of your website this is useful just select section and from here let's to explain you how to uh, let's say i want my uh, join my button to uh, redirect someone to a specific section on any page of my website just go to the page or just select your page from here and let's say this is the page i want to link to click on edit first select the section then click on edit section go to the anchor tab and give your uh, section a name for example newsletter update your website now go back to the header section click on edit header go to the style select the button and here you will start make sure to select section first and here you will start seeing your uh, saved sections this is the newsletter you can select to open this link in a new tab or not and to make this link no follow or do follow and to edit the button design in the normal state you can uh, select normal and start picking your button your fill color you can also edit the text color text font text size the button border color you can pick it from here and you can adjust the border width from here for the button corner you can edit the corner radius from here using this uh, bottom slider now let's edit the button design in the hover state hover means when the mouse cursor is on top of it as you can see you, when the mouse pointer is on top of it it turns to black you can edit this uh, hover state 
fill color now let's go with blue I think now it turns to blue you can also edit the text color for the for the hover stage and you can also edit the border color let's go with what or let's pick green for example now when I hover over, over the button with my mouse the border color turns to, to green the button background turns to blue and for the fill or the text color I will select black as you can see now it turns to black and to edit the style of the social icons it's simple just select it enable the social links you can delete a social platform if you don't use it from here and you can edit the social link from here let's go with facebook.com slash ben's experience hit this check button and you can also edit the order of the social links to edit the social links icon size you can use this slider and you can also pick a different icon color let's go with this red now let's update my website to not lose this editing and view this website live and this is my text my new header order with the menu in the left the logo in the center and the social links and or dedicated button on the right this is my new or the green menu color and also the red social links and also button and this is the uh, button design on the hover stage and this is how to change the design of your website header in hostinger website builder if you still have a question leave it in the comments below and don't forget to give this video a like thank you